Many of you are asking the size of my derma roller. I currently use a derma roller with 540 needles at 0.5 millimeters each. At 0.5 millimeters, I'm able to penetrate the dermis and reach the upper part of the epidermis and stimulate the regrowth of hair while keeping the risk of unwanted damage or scarring at a minimum. Now, I'm not telling you to avoid using a derma roller with shorter or longer needles. I'm simply telling you what has worked for me. In most studies showing the effectiveness of microneedling, derma rollers were usually around 1 to 1.5 millimeters in length. That being said, and despite what some of you say in the comments, my reasoning for sticking to 0.5 millimeters is based on a little bit of science. In the only study I could find comparing derma roller needle lengths, a derma roller of 0.6 millimeters was found to be significantly more effective than a derma roller of 1.2 millimeters. Of course, all of these studies should be viewed with a critical eye. The science behind derma rolling is still new and not strongly verified. But like I said, it's worked for me. In my next video, I'm going to finally give you guys the updates you've been waiting for. For six months, I've tested derma roller coffee, and a few lifestyle changes to see if they really make a difference alone and if they do benefit my hair, what happens if I abruptly stop after 30 days of application. I took plenty of photos and videos and I did my best to keep the lighting and angles as consistent as possible. Spoiler alert, I am pretty happy with the results. I hope to see you in that video and I'm wishing you all a happy and blessed day. Peace.